This is a flying toaster with working bacon missiles and muffin bombs. <laughs> oh, are you kidding me? Bacon missiles, eggs, eggs, and muffin bombs. These are eggs. And I don't know if the toast goes down, but that would be sweet if it did. All right, so this thing actually does fly too. And so what we're going to do is we're going to take it off. Uh, if you guys are just joining me for the first time ever, this is Simple Planes, a game where you get to design and play different planes. And then you can also download planes that the community has made. And this is one of them. <laughs> and uh, this can take off on the water as well as on land. But we're going to be taking off from the water since I guess this is the update. First of all, let me look at some. Oh, <laughs> no. No way. Are this going to land and destroy me? Uh, my toast! Freaking, you can launch the toast. That is just amazing. Alright, here we go. So, what we need to do is we just need to keep pulling back, apparently. It'll take off eventually at 170 miles per hour, I guess. Oh, no! Whoops, I did that wrong. Let me do it. <laughs> Let me do it again. Whoops. That's what happens when you, you, you roll, you uh, turn a little bit. It messes up your approach. All right, there we go. Keep pulling up, they say. Keep pulling up. That's probably what I didn't do was pull up all the way. What in the heck? I was pulling up the whole time, and I definitely didn't turn it. Hold on a second. That's not working. Let's try it on land. Since apparently I can't get it to work. I wasn't even turning the thing. Man, man. It's drifting to the side. You see it drifting? Look at it. I'm trying to correct it. We're good. We're good. It's it's airborne. No way. This is ridiculous. Ooh. Cockpit view. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Ready? Launch the toast in three, two, one. Bacon missiles. That's amazing. Mm, coming in for a landing. Bacon missiles. <laughs> Drop the eggs. Wait, do they explode? Hold on. Can we get over water? I'm not over water, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, and, and this thing this thing definitely flies too. Oh, it dropped everything. That would be sweet if it just like yoke just splattered everywhere. I don't think they do explode. Freaking flying toaster, man. This is incredible. This is a working Star Wars BB-8 droid. Look at this little thing. We got a floating head there. That's okay. So what we need to do is hit activator one to release from the little dock here and then throttle up and VTOL up and goes, oh, oh, oh. Okay, we're going, we're going. Oh, it'll just roll? I don't have to do anything. No, that's not true. The head is just going all over the place here. I, I, I gotta zoom out or something, man. This is, this is, this is tripping me out right now. Yo, okay. I don't know what's, I don't know what's happening. Wow, this is making me sick. It's not working how it's supposed to. It's just messing with... The, I think it got stuck. I think I went too fast. It said if you go too fast, sometimes it'll get stuck. All I know is that... That was a ridiculous view. Can we do, like, orbit view? Alright, here we go. Let's throttle up. Throttle 100%. And then... The, the thing is, you gotta... It's VTOL only halfway. I can't control how far down it goes, man. There it goes. Now we're going. Go, little droid, go! Oh, you can see it's like bobbling. That's what they're talking about, I think. All right, yeah, it got st <laughs> it got stuck. Well, I'm sure those who are skilled and can keep this thing. Oh wait, I can click and drag. I did not know this. 
They said about 50% is when it'll work the best. There it goes. Look at it going. Look at you, little droid. No! Keep going. Okay, I got it working now. Man, that camera view is tripping me out, though. In the first first time we did it. So you got to queue it about 50% and it doesn't go very fast. This is the IX529C Shadow. Look at that. That is sweet, man. Get that stealth going on. So the Sea Shadow was an experimental ship built by Lockheed for the U.S. Navy. And apparently it was kept under wraps for quite a while. There's something new like this now, isn't there? Something, Or is that what this is? There's something that's, a, I think it looks a little bit different than this, but there's something that was just built that resembles something like this. And I wonder if it's based off the original concept or if that actually is what this is. I'm not entirely sure, but uh, we're going to see what this thing can do. So, oh my gosh, the sea shadow. We got a cockpit view. Oh man, it needs to have a cockpit view. That'd be sweet. Is it? Oh, there it goes. There it goes. We're turning now. Sweet. Let's look at this from this view. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. Hold on, let me do that again. This time, let me go. Let, let, let go right through me. Yeah. Sea shadow. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Does this thing actually work? This is incredible. It's a freaking hoverboard. Air skateboard by Joshua W. And he's even got a little dude on there. Dude, no way. <gasps> That's so cool. Look at it. <laughs> freaking air skateboard. <laughs> hoverboard, baby. That is great! No way! Look at that! Dude! <laughs> this year for Christmas we've instituted a new hoverboard technology and it works gloriously. Air skateboard, baby. Air skateboard. That is so cool. That is so cool. Look at this! This thing is fast, too, and very maneuverable. Dude, you can, like, yeah, yeah. Oh, that was close. Look at this, look at this. I've never explored this map, actually. Dude. Too bad it doesn't have missiles or anything. <laughs> That'd be sick. Oh, this is sweet. Wait, let's put some, can we put some missiles on this thing? Or some, like a... Let me look and see what I can do. I, I'll probably, I'll probably will make this thing, mess this thing up big time. I just want to put, I just want to put some weapons on it. Who doesn't want weapons on? Oh, that's like the perfect spot for it too. Oh, that's sick. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Freaking sweet. That is a sweet design. Yeah. Yeah, man. That is so cool. All right, so wait, I want to I want to actually look at how he built this. So what are these? These are these are uh, structural wings. That's all this is, just a bunch of structural wings. How do you get them to snap together like that, though? And how do you do these overlay type of deals? Like that right there. Oops. Interesting. And then what the heck are these little things? What are these? Some kind of, like, little intake? It doesn't tell you what it is. I wish it would identify what it is. Input brake? It's an air brake? Gizmos. Nope. What is that thing? No, not a detacher. Should drop missiles and stuff. I don't know what it is. Anyway, let's check something else out. 
And last but not least, we finish off today with another thing from Walrus Aircraft. This is the Mad Max Maz Edition. Dude, look at this. It's just amazing you can make something like this. And it's got a cockpit even. That is sweet. All right, so instructions, power up to 50%. Okay, that's good enough probably. Look at that. The flames are coming out of the exhaust. That is so cool. All right, and then pull VTOL back three-fourths to move forward. There we go. Sweet. It even rolls. Oh, look at that. Individual, like, suspension there. Directional controls. That is great. Wait, what? What's it say? Detach or one is when you say goodbye, cool world. Oh my gosh. All right. All right. That makes sense. That's great. Good job. <laughs> this this game is amazing. It's just, it's so much fun. And it, I can't believe that you can make some of these things. It's craziness. Well, there's my thing in a wreck there. Well, guys, hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you have, click that thumbs up button below. Feel free to subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time.